What's up? Did we? Did I talk to you about JP? No. That was after. Oh, I went. Saved saw, I went and saw it. Jordan Peterson. Awesome. Got to meet him after. Went to the green room to meet the esteemed Dr. Peterson. By the way, that shit ruled. Yeah. It was like really good. At Who, first, I went with Francis Ellis. Nice. So me and him are just sitting there. Francis, for a Harvard man, didn't really follow along too well. Really? Yeah, I think it's more abstract shit. Francis has Francis is a book man. High in openness. Yeah. Yeah. I had you're to pretend. High in openness. Francis was like, "Do you understand this?" I was like, "Yeah, shut up." I'm yeah, listening. dude. No, I didn't understand. <laughs> At one point, he's like, "That's a Freudian nightmare, isn't it?" And I was like, "Who the fuck is Freud?" <laughs> <laughs> we had a good laugh. That's fun. Yeah, but uh, at one point, this is this is what made me laugh, and I mean this story with all due respect, sure. Doctor Peterson, uh, and Michaela. This is a complete respect. Absolutely. All right. So I mean, dude, exactly. Yes. Tip of the hat. Respectful as hell to the Canadians, our neighbors up north. <laughs> Stay strong. Stay strong. <laughs> Justin from Canada. <laughs> and uh we uh so we get done one of the things he's talking about is how when you look at something you're always valuing something so like your eyes you you value things naturally mm -hmm. so whatever you're looking at you're valuing that yeah that's what happened. <laughs> yeah that's exactly what happened all right so whatever you're looking at that's the most not the most important thing to you but your eyes you've decided you're, you've got a value system sure something moves quickly you naturally you look at it because that's an it could be a threat something sure. like that so you're assigning value at all times, basically, was what I gathered. Anyway, we get done. I'm talking to Michaela and Jordan. And while he's talking to me, I was just looking at Michaela's tits. <laughs> and it was, it was making me laugh so much that I was like, while talking to him, I was like, <laughs> I've assigned value. This is better. <laughs> and this is nothing but respect. Of course. I wasn't like oogling. I just happened to look over and see them. You caught, they attracted, you thought it was a threat. They caught your field of view. Like, is they, that a fucking buffalo? No, they're just. That was titties. not a threat. They're just damn titties. It was just damn titties. Damn titties. <laughs> them Canadian, that Canadian shot down. <laughs> <laughs> you caught them in your line of vision. I saw someone at Ottawa. <laughs> He said, is that a woolly mammoth? No, that's some no, motherfucking titties. That's in some sweater. milkies. It's Canadian milks. That's some big natties. And then I went back to respecting the doctor. That was big natties. It was, I saw some naturals. You assigned value to them. He's like, I value But those. in my head, I was I was like, should I tell them how funny that is? <laughs> like, I was almost going to tell him. He would have he would have fucking rolled his sleeves up. He may have he may have fought me. Yeah, well, he might have actually been like, well, I see what you did there. Yeah. It's clever. But yeah. he would have went... But that's extremely disrespectful, what you've done. Yeah, or you, but he might, might carry a knife. Yeah, he could have killed me on the spot. He might have. If I was or, dispatched or just, by JP, that'd be pretty tight. Sent to the next realm. But. Gains all your powers. He just Highlandered you. <laughs> he probably has it. He probably keeps a blade on him. I would I would imagine he keeps that thing on. Something. Bow staff up his sleeve that he can... <laughs> he might have staffed you. It was that, was that was a wise move to keep that under your fucking... Man. Yeah. If you that would that's a joke, I think he would have been like. I think that's a joke that even if they heard it now, they wouldn't really like that much. 